hi guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is gina and in today's video i want to show you guys how to make the best lip scrub yeah you heard me right this is actually the best lip scrub you can ever make for yourself so if you want to learn how to make this lip scrub then consider staying tuned to this channel don't go anywhere subscribe also click the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time we upload content like this all right now just like every other body part the lip also needs special care so to uh, uh, keep your lip fresh healthy and beautiful looking you need to always exfoliate before applying whatever you want to apply like maybe lip balm or whatever you want to apply to your lip you have to first of all exfoliate and this is what you're going to use to exfoliate your lip before applying any other thing. Without wasting so much time, let's just dive into making our lip scrub. Now, these are all the ingredients we are going to be needing for our lip scrub. We don't need so much. You don't need to bring down the heavens to make this beautiful scrub you're seeing. So, we just need sugar. Yeah, sugar. Is one of the best natural beauty ingredients to exfoliate your skin or lip sugar scrubs help exfoliate as it removes dead skin they also help rejuvenate the skin by cleaning all the dead from the skin pores and this will only leave your skin or your lip looking healthy and glowing now the next ingredient on our list is honey natural honey when you want to do this, you need this very natural honey, not this honey that they have mixed with so much water that is very watery. Yes, and we know that honey is one of the best ingredients when it comes to skin care or lip care, all right? So when you use honey to exfoliate your oil, to add to your exfoliating scrub, it's only going to help the scrub work well for your lip or your skin so honey has this natural healing properties which will help chapped or cracked lips to heal faster and also honey is also having this mild exfoliating properties to gently remove dry flaky skin without causing irritation so it's only best for us to add honey to our exfoliating scrub for better results yeah let's move to the next ingredient now the next ingredient we have is lactic acid Lactic acid helps in moisturizing the lips and also the skin. It makes the lips to stay hydrated and nourished. It also boosts collagen production. This only reduces lip or skin aging. All right, it will leave you with a fresh and beautiful lip or skin. So it's just best you add it to your, your lip scrub. Now, if you can't get lactic acid, or because most people will say it's very difficult for them to find this, so what's very common for you to substitute this um, lactic acid with is lemon juice. You can then add um, some quantity of lemon juice to your your scrub because they work the same. It works just like like lactic acid. So you're going to add lemon juice instead if you don't find lactic acid your scrub will still be fine so next we have light up serum and light top serum has to be added to your scrub why because light up serum is good for for a brightening of the lip or the skin it helps in in pigmentation and so if you add it to your scrub it's just going to help your scrub uh, to be more effective and to work well all right so you can add light up serum if you're doubting me this all these ingredients that i'm giving you here you can go ahead to to search or do more research on them and then feel free to add to your scrub but i've tried it and i know it's very effective so don't doubt just go ahead and put it in your scrub it's very good next you're going to add your food coloring yeah this is the super red food coloring so you're just going to add a little quantity of this and it will give you the color you desire i most people do their scrubs adding the the food coloring but if you don't have the food coloring you can still 
allow your scrub like that it will still be effective but i i love the food coloring because it gives you this beautiful color and just um just the color that your lip balm has and the scrub too can get this beautiful color yeah but if you don't have it it's fine you can go ahead and scrub your lip just to exfoliate before using your balm or your 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 vaseline then we have our measurement spoon in order to measure the lactic acid that's why i have my measurement spoon here and also an empty bottle to put the scrub in it when you're done making it so that's basically all what we will have for this scrub making I'm going to measure my lactic acid. I've measured it. This is 1.25 milliliters. Yes, I've added. I've added to my mixture. Yes. Mix, 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 mix. I want everything to be well mixed before adding. Okay, next I'm adding my food coloring. Yeah, food coloring. You don't need to put much because it will be very very red and you won't like that so just watch what i'm you see the small i've put just watch how it's going to be very very okay so you don't need to put much oh i broke my spoon i've broken my spoon yeah i replaced it for this because it's not gonna break yeah so you're just gonna mix 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 very well after mixing i had to add my light up serum and i'm just i didn't measure this but i just dropped i added some drops just see what i'm doing yeah added added some drops let's see six to seven drops or even more but I didn't really measure this. I just added. Has no bad effect like the acid. With the acid, you don't need to play. You have to measure. Just a small quantity. Yeah, so. After adding the light up serum, you continue mixing. So everything is well mixed. Mix, 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 mix. yeah at this point i knew i made a mistake because this in a a more open bowl like the other bowl that had the sugar but i decided to mix it here i don't know why because i needed an open bowl to mix very well but it shall mixed well it did now this is what we have it's looking so beautiful and very trust me it's very effective take a look now when i say this is the best is the best and it's time for us to put in our bottle yeah because everything is done and it's time for us to transfer into our bottle yeah our, our lip scrub is ready and you can exfoliate your lips even twice a week four to four three to four times a week yeah this is really really going to help your lips stay healthy fresh and looking beautiful always it's not just the other body parts that needs care your lip also needs care in short your lips needs more care. because you know when you're 
your lips are really beautiful your smile is beautiful very yummy in the eyes felt like something i could just eat but sorry it's not something you can eat you know it's looking very very beautiful so at this point you're going to exfoliate i'm just going to put up a video up here that will demonstrate how you're going to exfoliate your lips you just take the lip it doesn't it's not difficult you the, you the lip uh, scrub and you just your lips scrub 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 and later you wipe maybe with a tissue or a hand towel yeah that's just all you can do that and before you apply your lip balm or your lip or your lip gloss or your vaseline this is looking beautiful oh my goodness beautiful yeah guys so this is it if you want to try it try it and come give me your feedback but trust me when i say it is really really going to help you yeah that's that for this video if you watched up to this level thank you and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thank you for always watching and coming back to support your girl see you in my next video bye